Next, let's welcome from Linko Branch, Charlene. And her topic is, AI is helping people to better manage transport. Hello, everyone. My name is Charlene. And today, I want to talk about AI helping people to better manage transport. Traffic congestion is a big problem. Sometimes, it will make people late for work or school. I really don't like spending a long time on transport. And that is why I chose this topic. Have you ever gotten car sick because of traffic jams? Have you ever been stuck in traffic and feel anxious because an important event is about to start? Please let me share with you my thoughts about how AI technology will bring solutions to these problems. My dad uses Google Maps when he drives. It's like having a personal navigator, which can tell us the fastest way to get somewhere. It can update us in real time about routes, accidents, and even the available parking lots. That can save time, and my dad loves it. Sometimes, people are too tired to drive. Imagine how great it could be if we could just sleep in the car while AI drove for us. Autonomous driving technology can reduce the need for human drivers and then save money. I'm sure my dad will absolutely love this. Now, let us talk about how AI can help an entire city. Can you believe that the people in London, on average, were forced to sit in traffic jams for 156 extra hours last year? In New York, drivers spend over 100 hours a year on finding parking space. Wow, it's so terrible. In the near future, city-scale AI will most likely be able to manage the transportation network smarter than before, because AI can comprehensively analyze traffic patterns, control traffic signals, and then optimize the city traffic flows. AI can also enhance scheduling over buses, trains, and metros to shorten the waiting time. This will greatly improve the overall efficiency of transport and logistics. There's one more thing. This can lower the air pollution from vehicles, improving environmental quality too. In conclusion, there are so many benefits, such as time and money saving for people, efficient transportation network for cities, and cleaner air quality for the environment. Let's get together and embrace this new future. Thank you for listening.